Hello ladies and gentlemen, Sigvald Grim here and I got this tier complete on uh, normal on both accounts so we're going to take a look at that and other rewards so yeah with that being said subscribe if you enjoy the content and let's get into it okay so boss Grenada was left on this account to be beaten from yesterday and I'm, I'm just kind of fooling around with some uh, combo some infinite combo would grow out pretty much but he takes a lot of damage from that either like bro those fights are too short for me to be able to squeeze out an 8 minute video even with two accounts that's an impossible job so I'm not even gonna try to stretch this video to that point uh, and yeah, I, I'm glad actually that it's easy. This tier is very easy, by the way, I have uh, the um, sword thing, the one that power drains, I always forget the name, but yeah, this is most likely one of the best of the new artifacts. That's equipped over here on Catwoman. But yeah, I'm happy that this is very easy and I'm happy that Flash, I think, is the easiest tier 1 boss out of all the Rise Krypton Soul Raids. And that's great because that's how it should be. Because this will be the uh, Soul Raid experience for most players before getting King. So they have to deal with this before getting King and I don't think it's hard. He, he can get a little bit annoying with his uh, mechanics, but uh, he's n he's a silver flash, so he's nowhere close to the annoying uh, extent to of uh, multiverse flash or reverse flash. So yeah, he's gonna be fine. Special two in there, and yeah, really this this will this will be ended very very quick. We'll uh, do a video later on on the uh, sword. The one that power drains, again, forgot the name. But I'll do a video later today because I think it's a pretty powerful artifact. I only have it at level 3. But yeah, there's flash down from the first account. That was fast, not, not even 2 minutes in the whole video. And he's already down and we've already beaten a sub bus. So yeah, we got this classic Batman. I mean, look. You need classic Batman, uh, he's not a must-have but he really helps with the other Batmans because he passively buffs them just by being in the roster and he's no longer in the arena store so this would be a good drop. Only that I have him fully maxed out but again there's few gold characters that I don't have maxed out. But on the other hand that agility artifact screw that, that's, the that's literally the worst artifact in the game you can ever get. So not happy with that agility artifact, not at all. Over here we had Captain Cold. And kind of exercises the, exercising the combo interruption. And what I've noticed for some reason, the Captain Cold in League Raids is actually more easy to combo interrupt. It's far easier to combo interrupt than other Captain Colds that you randomly see in the story mode and in here. I don't remember League Captain Cold backing away in the middle of your combo, for example. But yeah, now getting into the real deal. Fighting Flash, this will be a very challenging fight, we might not be able to one-shot this over here. Looking for a special one in there, making sure we apply the burn correctly, because it might mean the difference between a win and a loss over here, ladies and gentlemen. We're on edge and one mistake can ruin it all. Special two in there, that's a crit, that's a crit. This will, this will count a lot, depending on if we hit crits or not uh, on actually killing this dude. So, very lucky that we got the crit there. Over here, it was a case of the special tree not wanting to trigger in time. Damn, this, this could have ruined our progress here. But thankfully, we will barely manage to one-shot him before the time ends. Let's go. So, yeah, the, the flash on the arrow account is down. And, uh, yeah, again, we're going to have the flash exploding animation. Hope you're enjoying it. You saw it two times already. Are you bored of it already? But, yeah, now getting into the rewards. Uh, Cold Captain Cold is shit, nobody wants that. And I'm a little meta human is not a bad artifact, but it's a bad artifact to drop because you get it often, really often, especially from league raids. So yeah, look, the the raid drops are shit so far, but at the same time, there, there are not many gold characters that I'd be happy dropping, but the artifacts, there's a lot of space for improvement, my dude. But yeah, all that being said, thank you all so much for watching. Please do like, comment, subscribe, and share if you enjoyed this video. Just like it if you dislike it, maybe hit that bell button. And I will see you all in the next one. Goodbye.